Hi guys, um, well the parcel's come through now, I um, ordered this uh, brand new pair of binoculars uh, about two days ago and it's uh, been delivered pretty quickly here. Yeah. Anyway, what we got here is uh, a pair of binoculars, Celestron up close G2 20 by 50 binoculars, uh, multi-use uh, binoculars they are. Right, let's get them opened. Just delivered this morning. There we are. You can see it's a nice tidy uh, carry case that comes with it. Um, nice uh, nice bag as well. Eh? Just grab these out here. And there's the, the manual that comes with it. Um, yeah, it's uh, have a quick look at that now later. It uh, probably comes in a couple of different languages, I think. Yeah. A couple of different languages there. Eh? So we'll have a look at that later. Let's get to the oh, yeah. it's uh yeah it's a nice uh it's like a rubber feel to it, like a rubber coating. It's a nice nice a good weight on them. Not too heavy, you know, manageable, easily manageable. Right, just put them over there for now. Let's just bag away. Right, uh, let's have a look at these then. It's got a central focusing wheel on it. So uh, obviously that uh, that's good, that's a good sign there. So we got um, the opter adjustment down on the right, uh, you know, which is uh, as per usual on binoculars, isn't it? You can adjust it for the eye, uh, differences in the eye. And uh, so that's that there. It's got dust caps already on there, both sides. Nice. Now these binoculars, uh, they got 3.2 degrees field of view or something. Uh, they are multi-coated uh, lenses, optics. It's got uh, the name on it there, uh, up close, G2 20x50. Celestone branded. It's got, um, they can be fixed to, um, to a tripod, just by undoing that there. I haven't got a tripod for them. Um, to be honest, I think uh, these will be easily manageable for me, but if I need to get a tripod, um, I will. So you just undo that anyway and fix onto a tripod. Anyway, these now, they weigh 790 grams, which is, a, you know, just over a pound and a half, really. A pound and three quarters. You know, that's, you know, easily manageable. They are multi-coated, as I uh, said. Oh, they got, um... What we got yeah let's leave these down by there for a minute there. the um bk7 uh prisms uh, yeah it's a nice feel to them let's take uh let's take, take a look at the take the lens off and the caps off let's have a look at them you see they 50 millimeter lenses it's uh yeah, they look uh, look really nice there. So, uh, see right in there. Let's take the other two off. Yeah, they can. Uh, these can be fold. The ends can be folded over there for spectacle wearers. Just by folding them over. Yeah. They got an exit pupil of 2.5 millimeter, so there's a you know a decent amount of light coming in there for daytime use. So you're not going to have any trouble with dark, dark uh, images or whatever you know or viewing. No dark viewing with these. You know these. There's a decent amount of light coming in there, so there's nobody's there. Like um, it's got. Uh, it does come with. Like I say, the bag has got a strap on it. It's also got a strap for the uh, for the binoculars, and there's the connector strap there, like one there, and uh, one the other side there. So we covered there for the strap. Um, what else? 
see if I can get some more information on it. Uh, Tripod adapter, well yes, we cover that. multi quarter lenses, yeah, 20x magnification. Says eye relief seven millimeters. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Um, the exit pupil, angle of field of view, 3.2. Relative brightness, 6.25. Yeah, it's... Uh, Right, they're water-resistant binoculars. High quality at an affordable price. Multi-coded optics for good transmission of light. Sharp images, high contrast level. Stylish rubber coated, aluminium body. Protects from rough handling. Er ergonomic thumb indents and finger ridges for good grip. Yeah, now these are, like I say, these are multi-use binoculars for sporting events, wildlife, bird watching, and uh, and a lot of other uh, uses. Yeah, it's multi-use, they are. Um, one of the reasons why I bought these um, is that it's got some pretty good reviews on Amazon. And when I say good reviews, I mean four and five star reviews, you know. Um, one or two on there that... You know, we always always find uh, a few that give you know one or two uh, star reviews, and you know you, you can't please everyone, obviously. But most of the people that have bought these are very happy with them, and that's one of the reasons why I decided to buy them. And not only that, um, it's a good price point. You know, um, I I bought other binoculars and I'm trying to work my way up to more powerful, and rather than just going straight in. You know, and spending a lot of money on, you you you've got to you've got to work your way into it. Try things out and see what you think. You will come across a pair that are very affordable, and you know, really really good gra um, optics on it. You know, that's that's the way you want to go. Try things out, and then you come across a model that's you know you're very happy with it, and you haven't had to spend a lot of money. You know what I mean? So. Judging what I've seen with these, the feel of them, the quality of them, for the price I paid, I I don't know, I, I can't, it's unbelievable. I mean, they're made in China, and I think that explains the quality and, and, and for, the, for the price point, you know. I mean, you wouldn't get, if these were made over here, you, you would never get them for that price. No, no way. So I can't wait to use them, to be honest with you, and I'm sure I'm going to have... Uh, a lot, a lot of fun using these. Like uh, oh, a couple more things. It's got a central focusing point on you, so it uh, that, that's good. Because some binoculars they come with adjustable lenses, you know, and um, but this is uh, everything's focused there on on the central wheeler. So um, yeah, these are going to be good, I think. If you're after a pair of binoculars, like these, twenty by fifty. Or even 10 by 50 because they, they do a 10 by 50 as well. Like a 10 by 50 is going to have even more light coming in. You know, we're looking at about um, it's a five millimeter exo pupil, which is double the amount of light that this, these are bringing in, and that's uh, that's even even brighter again. You know, so you could with a pair like that 10 by 50, you could you could be using these uh, those binoculars even when the sun is going down because they're gathering so much more light. Now these here can be used up to a certain point. Obviously, as the light goes down, whatever you're looking at will get darker because it's got a slightly smaller exit pupil. You know, when I say small, it's two and a half millimeter. Still a lot, mind. For daytime use, it's, it's more than enough. But as the light goes down at the end of the day, a 10 by 50 will be much more useful and brighter what you see through it compared to these because it's got double the exit pupil and that means there's more light coming in but um, they won't have the power that these have these got 20x whereas 10 by 50 will be half so um, anyway I hope you like uh, the unboxing and if you're after a pair of binoculars like this 
check the link below and uh, it'll take you straight to Amazon and uh, you can see this particular model and um, and lots of others on there you know and if you're after a pair you can check the reviews and then um, and take your pick really because there's, there's, uh, there's hundreds of pairs out there hundreds of different models so if you're after a pair check the link below and uh, and have a look at these because um, from what I've seen I haven't used them yet but for what I've seen so far these are going to be good and, and uh, I can't wait to use them anyway thanks for watching the unboxing and um, I'll see you in the next video cheers guys